Well, hello, everybody. Welcome back to another West Live. You ready to worship? We're going to do a little of that tonight. We're going to be giving God some praise. He is worthy of our praise. <clears throat> and there's something that happens when God's people just choose to turn to Him in thanksgiving and praise and give Him our love. Wow. Uh, it's going to be a great time tonight. Uh, it's been a great week. Felicia and I just got back last night for an amazing time up in uh, Guymon, Oklahoma. We had a fantastic time at Victory Memorial United Methodist Church with our dear friend David Player and his wife Cindy. And just what a delightful, awesome time of worship we had. Uh, and evangelism took place, man. I'm telling you, God showed up. We had great crowds, wonderful enthusiasm, wonderful response from uh, folks to the stories, and, and uh, my goodness, we had a great time with the children in Bible Quest. It was just, it was one of those times where you could tell that there had been a lot of prayer going on, that God's people had been talking to Him, and, uh, and had been asking him to move in our midst, and indeed he did. So I'm going to look and see if I can find the, uh, the broadcast here on, on our uh, um, phone so that I can kind of follow along with what's going on. So far I'm not seeing it. Let me see what's going on here. Make sure I've got it right. Somebody uh, uh, send me a message and let me know whether you're seeing this, and uh, we'll try to keep it keep it going tonight. Uh, I, I tell you, I, as you well know, I am technologically challenged uh, on these things, and it's uh, obvious, I think, to everyone as I do it that it's a, a little bit of a challenge for me, but we do our best, and I, I hope that uh, these broadcasts are a blessing to you and to your family as we share it together. I think I see it. There you are. There are already seven of you on. Welcome. Hey, Jeff, you, are, you never miss, do you? <laughs> Good to see you. Hey, Sarah, God bless you. Uh, we're going to be uh, just worshiping the Lord and uh, sharing some time together. Um, here we go with uh, one of my favorite old hymns, and I bet you can sing along with this one. It's called, Since Jesus Came Into My Heart. It goes like this. What a wonderful change in my life has been wrought Since Jesus came into my heart I have light in my soul for which long I have sought Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy on my soul like a sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart I have ceased from my wandering and going astray Since Jesus came into my heart And my sins, which were many, are all washed away Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy pull my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart There's a light in the valley of death now for me Since Jesus came into my heart and the gates of the city beyond I can see Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart 
floods of joy Oh, my soul like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart I shall go there to dwell in that city I know Since Jesus came into my heart And I'm happy, so happy as onward I go Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy on my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart I'm possessed of a hope that is steadfast and sure Since Jesus came into my heart And no dark clouds of doubt now my pathway obscure Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy for my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy for my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart Amen, my friends. Since Jesus came into my heart, that's why they call it good news. See, he makes the difference. He is the one who has done it all. And, uh, you know, the story, the story of all of that, how important is it that we not only know the story, but that we tell it? There are a lot of folks that need to hear it, aren't there? And some of them live under our own roof. Some of them live next door to us. <coughs> Pardon me. But we need to tell the stories. Hey, Byron. Hey, Susan. Jenny. Rodney. It's so great to have you folks with us tonight worshiping the Lord. Uh, and just declaring his goodness to us, and what he has done. What an awesome God we serve, right? Oh my goodness, how good he is. And all that he has done for us. The love he has shown. You know, uh, it's a, a love that never fails. And he has proven beyond a shadow of a doubt how deeply he cares for his people and how he draws us into his kingdom. And it was not an easy thing. The price that he paid for you and for me and for the ability that we have now to come before him and just to give him praise, it was a story that is worth telling. And listen to, listen to the story that the hymn writer has given to us of the reason why, the reason why we praise him tonight. One day when sin was as black as could be Jesus came forth to be born of a virgin Dwelt among men, my example is he Living he loved me Dying, he saved me Buried, he carried My sins far away Rising, he justified Freely forever 
And one day he's coming, oh glorious day. One day they led him up Calvary's mountain. One day they nailed him to die on a tree. Suffering anguish, despised and rejected. Bearing our sins, my Redeemer is he. Save me, buried he carried my sins far away, rising he justified freely forever, and one day he's coming, oh glorious day. One day the grave could conceal him no longer. One day the stone rolled away from the door. Then he arose over death he had conquered. Now is ascended, my Lord evermore. Living he loved me, dying he Save me, buried, he carried my sins far away, rising, he justified freely forever. And one day he's coming, oh, glorious day. Now, here's the good news. Are you ready? Here we go. One day the trumpet will sound for his coming one day the skies with his glory will shine wonderful day my beloved ones bringing glorious savior this jesus is mine living he loved me dying he saved me buried he cared my sins far away, rising he justified, freely forever, and one day he's coming, oh glorious day. the whole gospel there friends it's all there and it's all in the book it's a story worth telling isn't it it is a story worth telling God loved us he redeemed us he poured his love out for us draw, drew us to himself forgave us for the past gave us hope for the future man he's on our side isn't he he is on your side friend Whatever you're going through tonight, you need to know you are not alone. God is with you. And he will never turn his back on you. He will never turn away from you. If you will keep your hand in his, keep walking, keep going, God will not fail you. He is there. And you don't need to fret or worry because he is present right now in this moment. He is in our lives. And you can lean back on him. Just let your full weight rest on him. He can hold you. Be still my soul. Oh, I've gotten the wrong.
wrong key. You know, <laughs> that would have really been bad. <laughs> so here we go. Let's get it in the right key. Be still, my soul. The Lord is on your side. Bear patiently the cross of grief or pain. Leave to your God to order and provide. In every change, he faithful will remain. Be still, my soul, your best, your heavenly friend. Through thorny ways, leads to a joyful end. Still, my soul, your God will undertake to guide the future as he has the past. Your hope, your confidence, let nothing shake. All now mysterious Shall be bright at last Be still, my soul The waves and winds still know His voice who ruled them When he dwelt below Still, my soul, when dearest friends depart, and all is darkened in the veil of tears, then shall you know the loving of his heart. Comes to soothe your sorrow and your fear. Be still, my soul, for Jesus can repay from his own fullness all he takes away. Still, my soul, the hour is hastening on when we shall be forever with the Lord. When disappointment, grief, and fear are gone. Sorrow forgot Love's purest joys Restored Be still my soul When change and tears are past All safe and blessed All safe and bless it all safe and bless we shall meet at last
Amen. I think maybe that songwriter had been through some stuff, don't you? And sometimes it's good to talk to yourself, isn't it? Just to say, God, I need you in my life to speak peace. To speak peace to my soul like you spoke to the winds. And like you spoke to the waves. Because sometimes the winds and waves are pretty Pretty rough in our lives, aren't they? But the one who said, peace be still, he's still around. And he is with us tonight. Hey, Bonnie, Jerry, Judy, Sally, thank you so much for joining us. Hey, Jenny, Byron, my goodness, we've got a great bunch of folks who are worshiping with us tonight. We're delighted to have you on board have you a part of this, why don't you take a moment and click a button and uh, invite your friends to join us. And remember that even after the live broadcast is done, even after it's all done, uh, you can come back and listen to this as many times as you like as it, it'll be here. And we'll also try to get it up on YouTube and uh, make it accessible there and on Vimeo. So there are a lot of places where you can access this. Uh, but uh, God is a good God, and we're bragging on Him tonight. We are bragging on the one who has poured it all out for us. And uh, so we're going to keep that up, just giving Him praise. And remember, if you have a song, a hymn uh, that you would like to hear in the future, all you have to do is to leave it in the in the comment section and we would be happy to consider that for a future show just let us know and we'd be happy to do that you can also send us an email with your request at wesley at wesleyputnam.org wesley at wesleyputnam.org and we would be happy and uh, that's also a good place for you to send prayer request and we would be happy to pray for you and remember that uh we are booking right now for the spring of 2020. So if you are looking for uh, days of renewal and revival in your church, please call us uh, or send me a text or an email. And we would be happy to consider coming to your church and uh, sharing some times of ministry there. Uh, it's going to be a, a great time. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm so excited that God has given me the strength to keep doing this. There are a lot of folks, uh, of my friends who have already retired, but you know, I'm not interested. <laughs> I'm not interested in retiring right now. I want to keep going. Uh, God has given me a passion for this work, and I long to see the light come on in people's eyes as they come into fellowship with Jesus Christ. And, and just to tell the story of what he's done in my life. This is kind of a testimony song. I wrote it years ago. <coughs> Pardon me, back in the 70s. So you know that's been a while. It also says I'm a little old. <laughs> but uh, uh, it's a song that just reminds us all of what God has done for us in giving us a new beginning. I, I, one of the things I told the people in uh, uh, Guymon this past week was that God has moved in our lives and not a single one of us really wants to turn to God tonight and say, oh God, give me what I deserve. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I don't want what I deserve, and I don't believe you do either. You know what we want? We want another chance to get it right. That's what we want. And that's what this song reminds us of. It's called A Brand New Start. It's hard to believe when I look back on my life the Things that mattered to me I sought with all my might They 
left me empty and defeated I know what I really needed A brand new start That's what he gave to me His eyes on what I used to be With a brand new start He made me feel so clean And now I'm more alive Than I have ever been There are times even now All the guilt comes back I can't forget The darkness in my past Help me to know that I'm forgiven And by faith Receive that gift from heaven Of a brand new start That's what he gave to me He closed his eyes on What I used to be A brand new start He made me feel so clean And now I'm more alive Than I have ever been In Christ there is no condemnation This is the truth that sets us free can become a new creation when we believe when we receive a brand new start that's what he gave to me he closed his eyes on what I used to be with a brand new start He made me feel so clean And now I'm more alive Than I have ever been Than I have ever been Than I have ever been start hallelujah it's good stuff that's what he gave us he didn't give us what he, what we deserved we didn't he did not give us i'll get it out he did not give us what we deserved he gave us a chance another chance to get it right and that's uh, fantastic news and we give him praise for that um got time for one more here and <clears throat> pardon me, this is a song that I wrote. I, I still remember, matter of fact, uh, a week, two weeks ago, I was in Mangum, Oklahoma, where we had a revival there, had a super time with the folks there in that community. And uh, I was last there on September 11th, 2000. One was during that during our revival that particular event took place 
It was on a Tuesday night, and I remember that night in Mangum, Oklahoma, September the 11th, 2001, the church was full, absolutely packed, as people were confronted with the great need that we have for our God. And so on, on the 10th, September 10th, 2001, I had written this song. And it has always struck me how this song speaks to what happened on the 11th because what it did for a lot of people was it made us reevaluate what was important. I remember the night uh, of that event the newscast were filled with uh, answering machine messages. About 20 minutes of it that night. Just talking uh, as, as those answering machine messages played one after the other, the message was pretty much the same. Somebody in one of those towers and they were calling their wife or their husband or their child or their parent and they were saying goodbye. And they were letting them know how much they loved them. And uh, so none of them called their brokers, checked on their investments. They tried to reach out to what really mattered. And so this song was written the day before those towers fell, and it's called Treasures. gift of love in children shown can you believe how soon they've grown our legacy a loyal friend constant sincere a costly gift beyond compare more lovely with each passing year God's gift to me These are the treasures that I hold Each day I live their value grows More precious than the purest gold they are to me So now I come to testify richest man alive I found what money cannot buy love's mystery one day when life on earth is done and 
I stand before God's throne All those I've loved Who've loved God's name Will be the only fortune That remains These are the treasures that I hold Each day I live Their value grows More precious than The purest gold They are to me So now I come to testify I am the richest man alive I found what money cannot buy Love's mystery These are the treasures that I hold day I live, their value grows, more precious than the purest gold they are to me. So now I come to testify, I am the richest man alive. Found what money cannot buy Love's mystery Love's mystery folks our time is gone but uh, I thank you for joining us for a time of worship and we are going to try to do it again next Friday night at 8 hope that you can be a part of this and uh, be sure and let your friends know that it's happening we'll be doing it each Friday night at 8 and uh, Please keep this ministry in your prayers as we continue to do this work. God opens doors, and we are so delighted to be privileged to walk through them. And it is our prayer that God will continue to use this ministry to make a difference in people's lives. I hope it's been a blessing to you tonight. Remember, this ministry is supported through the generosity of friends like you. We would uh, be honored if you would see fit to help with your donations to this work, you can go to wesleyputnam.org slash give. wesleyputnam.org slash give. And uh, you either give a one-time gift or you can become a part of our regular monthly support. But we, are, we give God grateful praise for His provision and how He touches people's lives and asks them to enable this work to continue. So God bless you. Keep us in your prayers as I asked before. And remember, we want to pray for you, so let us know if there's any prayer need that you might have. And uh, we will see you again next Friday night. God bless. <laughs>